There you go. Hi there. I got myself this OB D2 diagnostic interface. Well, it's actually a device for you to connect to your car so that you can actually see what's going on with your car using your handphone or maybe your head unit as well. Well, it applies to Android head unit and yeah, it's actually pretty easy to install. Let me just open this up first. So let me just unbox this. And this is where you connect to your car. Yeah, it's basically a very simple device. So right, this is my Nissan Nextra or Nissan Rogue. And this is where the OBD2 location is. Uh, all you need to do is just take it out. Yep. And this is where you plug in that OBD. So this is my OBD2 device where I can check all kind of things in the car and I want to use the real dash. Yep. So I, all I need to do is just make sure the wider part is below. Yep. And yeah, that's about it. I don't think I can just close it. I need a smaller one if I want to close it. But anyway, um, I'll just keep this aside first you know, and let's test this out. So okay, let's open up the real dash and let's check out the iGarage. And let's open the door, click here on the dash and this is where you can add your OBD2 uh, device. Okay, let's add. And right now, mine is just a generic OBD2. So let's go and find that. There you go. Next, via Bluetooth. Next, it's now searching for it. Now there's this OBD2 and my iPhone as well. And that's it. This is a generic compatible vehicle, OBD2 is automatic, yeah, just leave everything be. Okay, um, OBD2 monitor, OBD2 monitor, okay, I understand, now it's connecting, it's connected, try and detect the protocol, everything looks okay. There is some error, but not too sure what is it. Um, basically, this is also showing that it's now connected, and it can, you know, see all my information in the car. So let's try it out. Um, would you like to set this protocol to this? Yeah, why not? Okay. Press the done. It's now connected. Press the X. Right, um, I think it's still under the simulation. Let's just try and clo close it. I mean, change it. How do I do this? Okay, um, let's go to the settings. And right now, it's still under simulation. So, data source is under yeah, whatever connections that I have made earlier. So, there you go. Now, this is less than one and same goes to this let's say i ref this the rpm see that immediately it's showing over here and that's pretty cool yeah all right so what else can i see once i'm connected to the obd2 I can see, yes, PSIs and uh, the temperatures. And the batteries, the fuel consumptions. Well, I don't think it's really connected yet. My fuel consumption is 8.6. It doesn't show here. Okay about this 
um, this is something different it's actually for your uh, map and your medias which is connected to your phone I mean which is connected to your uh, head unit and yeah throttle let's try there you see all right so immediately I can see the information here and what else can I do with this hmm. say or go dino start a new run well this is interesting let me just put on my seat belt and let me just stop the run first I really need to move the car you know in order to see the run start the new run the car is moving and you can really see that it's uh, recording all the data how fast I'm moving stopping or not yeah everything is recorded down so okay um, let me just stop aside and take a look at the graph so right I'm stop and let's take a look at this yes and um, the max power is uh, 9 horsepower at 1.5 1.5k uh, rpm yep yeah. max power is only at this and the max torque is only 70 you know kpa yeah that's how slow it is yeah my car but i'm not really uh, making a run uh, i didn't really push it hard i just want to take a look at how the data looks like once it's um, you know it starts to to see all this well i just want to see that it works okay so let's close this and it starts to you know take some information about my car uh, test run so all right uh, thanks for watching and uh, this is how you do a connection and yeah if you really like this you know give me a thumbs up and if you want to see more of this you know, please click on the subscribe button and this will help me to get YouTube to share this video to more people and have a nice day. Bye.